The first thing you'll want to do is to get on the SeaWorld's website and view the nights that they're doing their fireworks show. It's not every night and it only goes from 8.50 to 9.00 p.m. Then load up the kids in the car and head down to Fiesta Island. Taking the SeaWorld Drive exit, you'll head towards Fiesta Island. You'll notice that it's one-way traffic only and you'll want to head for the southwest corner of the island as indicated by the star and you'll see the barge where the fireworks are launched from. Fiesta Island is a unique place where you can drive your vehicle out onto the sand, but be careful, we saw more than one car get stuck in the sand. It was pretty crowded when we first got there, but we noticed around 7 p.m. a mass exodus happened. We were able to find a little spot of beach where we had our space to ourselves. It's a good idea to bring your bathing suit, towel, and lawn chair, and then a change of clothes as it gets cooler at night. You can bring an assortment of things down with you to occupy your time while you wait for the 8.50 start of the fireworks show. We brought dinner, our gas fire pit, s'mores, and games to play around the fire. We also brought down water to wash our hands with as Fiesta Island does not have any public restrooms. They do have porta potties. No Busy Bees is complete without something sweet to eat. We brought our fire pit and s'mores. As it was now 8.50 p.m., the sun had set and the show had begun. <laughs> 